Ready for bed? Yeah. Alright, ready? Knock, knock. Who's there? Cutie. Cutie who? Cutie you, that's you. <laughs> Alright, have a good night, okay? Yeah. Yeah, it was just there when I opened the door. It's so weird. So are you going to show it to me? Yes, but you're not going to be seeing it tonight. Come on, babe. I want to see it. Just bring it over. We can have some fun with it. I told you I'll bring it by tomorrow. Uh, you're no fun. You're lost. Anyway, i got to get some sleep. See you tomorrow. Okay, bye.
Jolie, watch whatever you want on TV. Just watch it in the room at the end of the hall so the kids won't hear you. Back at 10. Thanks, Lori. real. That settled that then. Hey, Joe. Lori? Hey. Um, I hate to bother you. Um, it's okay. Are the kids... Oh, yeah. No, they're fine. Uh, they're out cold. Listen, Lori, um, can I, can I watch TV in a different room? Any other room? What's going on, Jolie? Oh, nothing. Uh, I, I just, I just can't look at that new creepy clown doll anymore. Um, Jolie, what new clown doll? Come on, Lori. The huge life-size one in the den, sitting in the chair. One that's been watching me watch TV all night. Jolie, we don't have a new clown doll. At least not one like that. We never have. Jolie? <sighs> Jolie? What's going on? What clown doll? Are the kids okay? Joe!
Tomato. <gasps> Red! Red, you need this. It's just a phase. 
Rex. He acts like she's still here. Oh, you want to hear about the flying dinosaur? Well, I don't know what he's called. He flies, but he's dangerous too. Okay, well, I gotta get going with dinner, so I'll uh, talk to you later. Oh, no. Humans didn't exist when the dinosaurs were, were alive. Yeah. talking to you. Matisse? Matisse! Rockabye baby. You want to hear Rockabye baby? No, Claire wants to. What's her favorite? No, Matisse, she doesn't. Claire yes, is not does. here anymore. Listen, you want to hear the song. Tell mommy you want to hear the song. She's not here. Mommy, you're wrong. She is. Look. What are you talking about? She's not there. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. Why can't you believe me? She's right there. I believe you, baby. I believe you.
Baby, why aren't you sleeping? Grandma won't let me. Oh, baby. <sighs> Mommy, I want to be with Claire. I want to be with Claire too, baby. I want to be with Claire. hear people say you don't get to choose who you are when you're born. What the? But you can choose who you are when you grow up. Definitely many perks of the job, like free healthcare, and no one seems to bother me on the street. But I guess it's hard being the angel of death when all you want to do is help out. Like this morning, for instance. There's walking stick. I think the biggest misconception is, is that I'm out to kill everyone. Really, I'm just trying to be a good citizen. <laughs> Part of the day job is writing down their names when there's a wallet. She only had an address. That's how it all started.
What are you doing? What are you doing in here? So she's dead. You don't remember me, do you? Fun times. This is so cool. Do you want to hang out? I don't know why I stayed with her so long. There was just something about her. I had fun, and she made me do things I'd never done before. We could talk about anything, and even when I accidentally killed someone, she didn't mind. She was, oh, she was perfect. She made me forget who I was. Came the party. I'm getting clothes out for the party we're going to. Well, they're not for me. Fine. Do you want to dance? Suit yourself. Come on. In that moment, I could see I was losing her. And fast. I knew what I needed to do. If I really wanted her, I had to take a chance. And maybe she would hold out her hand. And our dance could begin. Life and death together. But it didn't happen that way. Where 
Mom, Mom, English, please. We have a guest. Fine. It's your turn to do grace. Mom, listen to your mother. Dear baby Jesus, thank you for this good day. Thank you for this good food. Thank you for Mom who made the food. Thank you for our guest today. And I Rory, we have. Are you okay, baby? Baby, I'm um, fine. It's okay. Anyway, um, once again, thank you for our wonderful guest today, and I pray that we have a, a great day all together. ¿Trajiste una pendeja a mi casa? Pero, pero ¿por qué está haciendo eso? Parece una bruja. Mamá, no es así, es buena. No, you got. Está loquita. Get rid of her. see how much a room is for the night. Hey, what about that one across the street? Huh. I didn't even see that in the hotel. Well, how about you go across the road and see how much that one is, and we'll see which one's cheaper. All right. room how many peoples uh just one room any pits uh, no 5550 thanks hey this one's 5550 so so's that one really this one's closer. You want to just stay here? Yeah, sure. <laughs> hey, again. We're going to take the room. Uh, this looks exactly like... Uh, how many peoples? It's just us. Any pits? No. 95.50, please. You don't remember me? I, you said it was 55.50 for a room. Fifty-five fifty, one person. Two peoples, ninety-five fifty. Oh, oh. You don't understand here. We, we just need one room. Okay, we're going to share a room. Is, is that what you don't understand? You think we need two rooms? Two people, one room, ninety-five fifty. You're serious. All right. I'll give you sixty. Ninety-five. Fifty. No, it's either sixty or we leave. 
You want us to leave? Is that what you want? Fine. You just lost a customer. Probably your only customer of the night. How do you feel about that? Hmm? Feeling pretty ridiculous now, aren't you? Let's get out of here. You know, you're not the only motel on this road. There's many other motels that we could stay at. I just don't want you thinking that you're the only one. Because you're not the only one. I'm just saying that you're not the you're not the only one. Yeah, we're uh, we're gonna take the room. How many peoples? Uh, it's just us. Any bits? No. 150, please. Wait, 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 wait. 110? I was just in here and you said 55-50. Yes, 55-50 for one person. Two peoples. 150, please. You know, the guy across the street, he offered us 95-50 for one room. No. Uh, yeah. So if you want us to stay, you're going to have to bring your price down. I sorry, I can't do it. Let's let's just go get the room in the other motel. You know, I'm, t I'm tired. I just don't want to deal with this crap anymore. It's fine. You know, buddy, you just lost yourself a customer. Get a good look, because you're seeing us walk out your front door, and that's money out of your pocket, pal. Only now, we're not coming back. How's that feel? Literally, two of us, money out of your pocket, out the front door. Suit yourself. All right. You got us. We're going to take the room. How many peoples? What? How many peoples? What do you mean, how many peoples? It's just us. Any pits? No. 150. 100? What happened to 95? I talked to my neighbor across the street. He said charging too little. Too little? What's wrong with you peoples? Brad. No, no, no. Listen, I'll give you the 95. Sorry, I can't take that. I have to keep up with competition or I go out of business. Competition? But there's nobody else here. How do you... Maybe you don't get the idea behind competition. The idea is you lower the price or we walk. Sorry, I can't do it. It's fine. We're walking. Fine with me. This is really starting to annoy me. Let's just go. I mean, my guy said 55-50. You heard him, right? No, I heard my guy across the street. <laughs> How did you hear your guy? Well, my guy said the same thing. Wait, what is that? What? That over there across the street. Is that another motel? Looks like it. Not a joke. Must be some kind of strange motel monopoly on this road. Is anyone here? I don't think so. room. How many peoples? We, 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 we don't have any pets. It's okay. Pets are free. Oh god. It's 95 pets. Oh god. Oh. 
Yeah. Are you to be having vehicle? Yeah. yeah. $40 for parking. You know, I can't keep doing this. Let's just go. Let's get out of here. I don't know about you, but I've never heard of foreign triple motel barons before. Let's just go. Hey, there must be other motels up the road. There's not. Not for miles. Let's just go anyways. I'll drive. No. First time we see how much the first guy charged for parking. No, Brad, I'm not going to pay $150 to sleep for three hours, okay? That's insane. The sun is coming up. Well, good for the sun. Brad, stop it. Get out of my way. Stop it. Get out of my way. <laughs> Yes. So your rooms are one hundred and ten fifty, right? Yes. Okay. Do you charge for parking? Yes. How much do you charge for parking? Thirty dollars. So thirty dollars? No, it's not bad. Yes, it is bad. It's the same price as the other place. No, this is what we want. This is where we're going to stay. Let's just go. No. Brad, are you crazy? Listen, I'll put it on my credit card. I'll get the points. We won't leave empty-handed. Sorry, no credit card. Cash only, please. What's your step? I'm not going to spend 150 cash for a motel room. That's just insane. It's only $75 each. It's still not bad. Well, think about what you're saying, okay? It doesn't make sense. No. That's where you're wrong. They want to play this game? They don't know who they're dealing with. I'm prepared to pay twice that. Well, think about what you're saying for a second, okay? Just think about what you're saying. <laughs> they just don't want us to stay here tonight. Don't you understand? It's all a game to them. Look, let's just go. That'll fix this whole thing. No. We can beat them. What does that mean? Honest to God, Roger, I'm going to stay here tonight. Do you understand me? Roger. Wake up. What? What? My dad's wanting us the money. We're golden. Right. It's it's morning. I know. We're close. It's starting to take form. We're almost there. What's that on the windshield? What is this? Are you trying to screw with us now? Well, I got news for you, pal. We've got money on its way. So you haven't won. It's not over. I just want a room. I'm freezing. I'm tired. And I can't keep on doing this. You win. You win. Okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Is that what you want to hear? I'm sorry. I just want a room. How many peoples? Any peoples?
bits. Hey guys, it's Lulu, your favorite foodie. And today I'm going to be reviewing Tim's famous double decker burger on Lulu's No Soy Reviews. Look at this monster. <laughs> so we're going to make today a burger day. And the reason I'm so excited is that I get to stuff myself with burgers all day long. Jesus Christ, Carol. Can't you see I'm working here? You're promoting death again? The hell? Are you PMSing? Meat is murder. Meat is good. Burgers are good. So why don't you quit harassing me before I go tell mom again? Why don't you tell your nine subscribers the truth? Soy is the way. FYI, soy sucks. <laughs> so disgusting. Oink, oink. That burger is murder. And I don't want it anywhere in this house. Do you hear me? If you only knew what they did to those poor animals, you would not be enjoying that thing. This thing is a delicious mouth-watering work of meaty art. It's murder. Can't you see that? I can't believe you're promoting the mistreatment and exploitation of animals just to get likes on some stupid online video channel. My channel isn't stupid. It's fairly educational. And my 67,000 subscribers love my deliciously meaty food reviews. So take your vegan crusade elsewhere. Welcome back to yet another one of Lulu's No Soy Reviews, just for you. That and burger you. is murder. As you can see, it's a charcoal burger with all the delicious fixings. Mmm, this is heaven on a bun if heaven was full of dead charred cows and smothered in Tim's famous secret sauce. Mmm, 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 mmm. what's wrong with this mm. world. Mm. And this is actually one of the best burgers I've ever had. It's rare and juicy with just enough charm. Mm. 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 Lou! What now? Say tofu, bitch. At least four people have been killed and ten injured following another attack by the so-called vegan vigilante. This time at an all-you-can-eat steak and lobster buffet in a small rural town outside San Antonio, Texas. This individual is responsible for approximately 15 murders, 12 assaults, and an attack on a 4th of July hot dog eating competition. Hello? Oh, hey. Where are you? No, it's a good time. No, I'm just getting in the door. Yeah, it was a long day. Actually, I'm not doing uh, anything tonight. <laughs> yeah, I'm keeping it real simple. Tired, man. Actually, I picked up uh, an apple pie yesterday. Well, a slice of pie. So I'm pretty much just going to eat that and uh, watch some Netflix, you know. The life of a solo traveler. Yeah. No, it's like my favorite apple pie. So, and it's vegan, too, which is good, because I just uh, switched to vegan. It's the, the hip thing to do these days, they say. Yeah. Um, no, I mean, I'm trying to catch you later, though. Yeah, for sure. I mean, maybe I'll give you a show. Uh, 
I'm going to be honest, I'm probably not going to go back to Yeah, I'm pretty stoked to just watch uh, Netflix and eat my pie. Yeah, I'm sure we can do something next week, though. Yeah, for sure. All right, dude. Okay. Peace. Netflix and pie, 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 Netflix and apple 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 pie, Yeah, David's coming. He just... Yeah, yeah, he went out to get Halloween decorations and a costume, apparently. Yeah, I know it's only September, but what can I tell you? He's into all that spooky shit. Okay, okay, but call me back. I'm trying to hear about this guy you're seeing. I'm not nosy. I'm just curious. All right, all right. Okay, cool. Bye.
David? If that is your sad attempt at trying to frighten me, unoriginal. I think I merit something a little more bone chilling than a white bed sheet. Honestly, David, don't be a meatball. This isn't funny or scary. Take off the sheets. Let's go watch Netflix. David? David, I'm not in the mood for this. My tits are sore, my back aches. Cut the shit, okay? <sighs> Baby, if you're in the mood to be under a sheet, why don't we take this to the bedroom? I could put on that little thing you like and we can play naughty ghost games together. Fine, whatever, but this is getting really weird, okay? Even for you. I know it's almost Halloween and you're in all this horror shit, but I'm not, you know that, so quit it. It's not cute. I'm not gonna <laughs> For fuck's sake, David. Is that what you wanted? I'm scared now, okay? You're a real jerk.
Fourth of July hot dog eating competition.